uh, Rodrigo Carvalho. I am the vocalist. Uh, hi, my name is Bruno Segovia. I'm the bass player in the band. My name is Jason Belisha. I am the drummer. I'm uh, Adam Mitchell. I play guitar. My name is Pablo Davila, and I play guitar in the band. I am originally from Brazil. I am from Santiago, Chile. I'm from Atlanta. Born and raised. I, I just woke up here. I'm originally from Argentina. Um, I'm actually born and raised in Atlanta, so one of the few in the band that is actually from Atlanta. Uh, I met Paulo through Craigslist, uh, which would be a recurring theme. I think a lot of us met through Craigslist. The misconnection section. Met uh, the bandmates through Craigslist. I ended up in the band uh, over a Craigslist uh, ad type of thing. I thought, like, if I want to attract a band that has the same kind of mentality as me, like, maybe not do, like, another metal video. Maybe do something like one of the more eclectic uh, groups that I like. So I did a Mars Volta cover of a medley from Bedlam and Goliath because it's got the sickest drummer on there. I'm like, why not put my spin on something that's absolutely wild and a total challenge for me to learn to play? And um, it turns out that I attracted exactly the right people because, um, yeah, they, they picked me up from that video. music style I mean personally it's um, like some post hardcore with metal um, but there are so many elements of so many different uh, styles we draw from Latin music alt rock uh, all sorts of different things worldly I guess uh, I, I always feel that it sounds cinematic very big very uh yeah just kind of worldly and cinematic is how I would explain it I mean aside from just saying like metal or something yeah um, if I had to describe the band's sound, it's really hard to sum it up, um, but I would say it's very dynamic, um, emotional, eclectic, um, but at the same time it's committed, um, it's not, even though it draws from a lot of different influences, it doesn't seem like a random thing that's thrown together, um, it seems cohesive and just somehow makes sense. It is eclectic, it is like... It pulls from maybe the last 20 years of metal, um, as well as like other worldly genres, and but it doesn't sound generic. Like that type of description sounds like it's gonna it would it would describe something that kind of glazes over a lot of things, but it actually gets super specific about how we pull from these different influences. So, you know, one track could have like an influence from world music and latin music some metal some punk and fused together in a way that i feel is really graceful it's not kind of jammed together in general i consider it metal but we all listen to such a wide array of music that um i'd like to say it, it sounds very worldly um but we try not to we try not to force anything in. You know, most of us grew up listening to to Latin music, uh, um, not just from Argentina, but from everywhere, like salsa and everything. Um, but we try to, you know, we don't want to put congas on everything. You know, like we we, we feel we feel we're able to incorporate it pretty naturally. Um, so definitely metal, but we, uh, we we like rhythm, and we we also. Uh, I think we're we have some elements of doom at times, and um, I don't know a lot of alt rock stuff. I, I listened to a lot of alt rock growing up, and some of the guys did too. Oh, 